sure you know that cleavage and implantation, both of them are occurs after fertilization. Yani, uh, after fertilization, which occurs within the fallopian tube, area of the fallopian tube, the cycle do not after implantation, after uh, fertilization. Look, after implantation, the zygote, our zygote, yeah? this one, it begins a series of mitotic division. It means what? The zygote, which is 2N, it begins a series of mitotic division. It becomes two cells, and then four cells, then eight cells, okay? This dividing, called what? Called cleavage. At the end of these cleavages, we have a ball of cell which is not much larger than the zygote. So the geometry the zygote, Basha, is called what? Called morula. Okay? So, who can tell me cleavage, it means what? First, cleavage is a series of mitotic divisions. First, two. Where it occurs? It occurs within the, yeah, it happens in the fallopian tube. Three. After fertilization, right? Three, and also it results in what? Yani at the end, mean that at the end of the cleavages, we have what? We have a ball of dividing cells called morula. What you can say it results in a ball of cell called morula. Tamam? Two. So what about the morula? You can say morula is what? Is a ball of dividing cells. Moriola is a ball of dividing cell. It's about 16 to 32 cells. Two cell, four cell, eight cell. Moriola may be 30, 16 or 32 cells. Tamam? But not included for you. Careful. Moriola is a ball of dividing cell which is not much larger. than the zygote. And still within the, it remains within the fallopian tube. So we have four things occurs within the fallopian tube, which are fertilization, cleavage, the dividing is, three, production of the moriola, four, production of the zygote. Fertilization, zygote, Cleavage, production of the morula, all of them are occurs within the falcon. Okay? Test. Two. After the morula is, has been formed, it transmitted to the, yani, pardon, we go on to reach to the uterus. Here is the uterus. Ed. Uterus, or you can say, Years, right? Morula do what? Transmitted to the uh, uterus. But initially, you have to know what? The cells in the morula, the cells in the morula, they do what? That results in the production of another structure which is called blastocyst, right? This is the blastocyst. A blasto cyst. But initially, you have to know what the cells in the morula, the cells, they do what? Yet yeah? they divide two and then they release a fluid. Result in what?
Basha, another uh, ball of dividing cell called blastocyst. Oh, this one. So initially you have to know what? Yeah, first. The cells in the morula, after it reaches to the uterus, it remains morula? No. 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 It changed, converted to, yeah, progressed to another structure which is called blastocyst. blastocyst. Two. The cells in the morula, they do what? Divide. Results in another structure called blastocyst. Divide. They divide and release an in fluid, not inside. Sorry. Three. So what about the blastocyst? Blastocyst also is a ball of dividing cell. Right? Bala, it contains fluid, right? So you can say blastocyst is a ball of dividing cell with large large fluid filled cavity. Uh -huh. uh -huh. You can't find it just like this. Uh, a ball of dividing uh, cells with large fluid filled cavity. Okay? But blastocysts do what within the uterus? You have no it in order. Yani, but this is too bizarre. Yeah. Initially, the blastocyst in the uterus it do what? First, is attached. Attached to the thickened, thickened line. Okay. After it attached to the thickened lining, look here, here, do what? Then it releases uh, an enzyme. The enzyme do what? The enzyme it breaks down this thickened lining. Okay, but initially it attaches, then it releases an enzyme. This enzyme do what? It breaks down. Right? I think it breaks down the epithelial tissues. Right? The epithelial tissue that lined the uterus. Three. After it reaches the inside, then it do what? It burrows and embed itself into the thickened lining. يعني باشر إذا ما كان الزكاة ولا بيسروا الدبي استكا حاول تقني بكردي ودستنادي كوات الذين الدول البروز and embedded embedded itself into the secret line secret lining this process that the that the blastocyst embedded its borrows and embedded itself into this thickened lining this process called what implantation. called implantation this push implantation yo quick review you can't tell me fertilization occurs within the phallic right? Mm -hmm. Two. So you can see the zygote is formed after fertilization also within the Three. After the zygote initially do what? Within the phallic It begins a series of mitotic divisions. Thank you. The mitotic division initially the cell becomes two cells, four cells, eight cells. So dividing continues. At the end of the cleavage, we have a ball of dividing cell, which is called morula. If you compare between them, you see that morula is not much larger than the zygote. When yeah, right? Three, four, three. The cells in the morula do what? 
after it progresses to the yeah before it progresses to the cluster cyst divide, divide. yeah they divide the cell do they release after come on so it results in another ball of cell called blastocyst you can't tell me the blastocyst it still remains within the fallopian tube no it initially attached to the uterus lining right can't tell me blastocyst is what is a is a ball of dividing cell with large fluid field cavity right attached to the thickened lining then it releases what enzyme the enzyme breaks down this thickened lining three and into what boros and empties itself into the thickened lining this process called what implantation so can't tell me from the fertilization fertilization until implantation it needs how many days seven days right you can see also a week and directly with implantation we have what directly with implantation we have pregnancy Well, time was the in the first day of ovarian cycle. Twenty first day. Why? So you can imagine. I was concerned about ovulation. Ah, take it. Look. For example, our ovarian cycle, we, which begins from zero to twenty, right? If ovulation occurs, someone always at the midway. You miss right. 14 day ovulation. If the question was just like this, if ovulation occurs during, for example, 15th, right? Past the membrane. So can tell me implantation maybe occurs in which of the following, for example, days? Plus seven. Uh, plus seven. Oh, past there. 16, 17, 18, 19. 20, 21, 22nd of Well, right? So you can see also time series Kishpke. Which one following is right regarding the third phase of ovarian cycle, which is luteal phase? Two. You can be able to see implantation occurs during luteal phase, right? Yeah. Co production of the corpus luteum also occurs during third phase. Yeah, I was right. Perfect. The implantation occurs the same time the corpus luteum forms. Yes, you're right. So, I think that's right.